You've got to tune to the afternoon show. It's listener-powered, KEXP. And right now in the live room, also playing Capitol Hill Block Party tomorrow, Thunder Pussy, and I believe the weekend is officially starting Woo! right yeah! now. Thunder Pussy live on KEXP.
Thunder Pussy live on the afternoon show playing the Capitol Hill block party tomorrow at 445. Thunder Pussy, Molly Sides, Whitney Petty on the guitar, Molly on vocals, Leah Julius on bass, and Ruby Dunphy on drums. And welcome to KEXP. Thank you. We made it. You did. It's so great having you here. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for inviting us. You bet. Perfect for a, uh, a Friday afternoon, too. Now, you've been taking the city by storm with the live performances, uh, but you're still relatively new and unknown to a lot of folks. So uh, tell me about how, you, how the band got together. <laughs> we got a demo in 2014, yeah, yeah, right? That's, yeah, you did. You did. <laughs> you've had that for At a the while. We, we have, yeah. We spray painted those, made our own little pamphlets, showed up at that front desk. Well, here you go. Yeah. <laughs> And we played it. <laughs> yeah, it yeah, you did. It's so awesome, right? Oh, man, yeah. I can't thank you enough. I mean, this is the greatest. You this is the greatest radio station <laughs> in the world. You can literally just bring your demo to the radio station and, and it might get played. That's it's, cool. it's true. It's true. But yeah. uh, we feel just honored to be able to play the music. You guys make it. Yeah. So thank you. Uh, yeah. well, we, we love making it. And honestly, I mean, it's just what it's, we have. To, it has to come out of us. So... To answer your question, this was pretty organic for us to get together and start making music. We, we were all in different bands, though. Exactly. We, we'd all met at, at other other gigs and different stuff like that. and Except for Ruby, who's the newest member of the band, and um, she just <laughs> kind of got roped in. <laughs> yeah, she was, I, it's kind of awesome, actually. She just kind of... There was rumors that we needed a, a new drummer. Yeah, yeah, you'd been having <laughs> sub-drummers for a while. Right. Ruby, can you grab the mic for a sec there? Bye. Uh, so, so you actually kind of have a jazz training. Yes. Yes, sir. Um, so, how how does uh, that convert to Thunder Pussy and uh, just playing really hard rock and music? Yeah. Well, you know, it's a really bluesy sound that Thunder Pussy has. So, you know, it's really easy to just finesse into that with all of my training. Yeah. You know, it just I think it's a perfect fit. Yeah, me too. I could hear it in that last song, Fever. Just some really nice oh, subtle yeah. touches in it. <laughs> So, uh, well, welcome to the band. So the Thanks. band is, is, yeah. is together now. Uh, again, we've had some demos for a couple of years. You've posted them up on your site. Mm -hmm. um, did, uh, did Jack and Dino work with you? Have you worked with Jack? Yes. Did, yeah. That yeah. was actually, we wrote a few songs. We kind of got roped into another awesome project. Um, we made a movie. All of us made a movie last summer, um, a movie called Danger Diva. I don't know if you are aware of Shredder Orpheus by... Um, Robert McGinley back in the day, but um, he kind of did a sequel. Anyways, yeah. we we wrote um, we wrote two tracks for that, and we got the got to record with the mastermind Jack and Dino. How was that? Father of, he's what? great. Jack has really perfect pitch. It's like almost kind of otherworldly and, and also kind of annoying you're like jack i don't hear it out of tune like really is it out of tune you're play it again play it you know, again he is a, he's amazing behind the controls so that was like you know working with a master it was really cool well that's pretty awesome yeah. uh i'm sure a great learning experience now you, you don't have anything out yet but you're about to head into the studio speaking of amazing indeed uh and you are recording your debut with producer sylvia massey and uh, Sylvia has worked with Tool, Johnny Cash, Prince. I mean, so t tell me how this came about. <laughs> You'd laugh. It, we, were, we were actually just really lucky. Um, yeah. There's this website called Creative Live um, where you can basically watch, take online classes. And Sylvia Massey uh, was roped in to do a recording workshop for two days. And we randomly were the band that got asked to do it. So we spent two days uh, at a vast studio with her back in March. And I think... After about an hour of us, after we met her, the three, four of us, we like walked in the other room. We were like, oh my God, yeah. like this is, this is the one. And so the two days were fantastic. And she was probably feeling the same way. I hope. I, I mean, I, it seems she, I she said so. Yeah. <laughs> and she agreed to make the record. So those are all good, good starts. Yeah. So, so what happens? Like, do you go, where are you going to do it? We're going to Ashland, Oregon, where she has a studio. Mm-hmm. But we, we, yeah, we. <laughs> and have you already written all the material? Yeah. Uh, we're just actually, it's funny. We've been so hyper focused on writing new material. Um, the festival this weekend, Black Party, has sort of crept up on us, and now we have to. We had to go back and rehearse <laughs> some of the songs we're playing now, some of our older songs, and we were all kind of joking, like, I hope we can remember our older songs, because once you get in that writing mode, you're just yeah, yeah. everything else kind of falls away. So we're we're writing a lot of new stuff. Sylvia's. 
I asked us to just make as much music as we can, so I we think have the a number huge... was 50. We have 50 songs. Seriously? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She wanted 30 to 50 <laughs> song starts. And, and have so. you been sending her songs in advance, yeah. so you're getting feedback going already? And... Yeah. yeah it's, and it's that's kind of that's kind of the best part about this process too is actually hearing somebody else's feedback because once you get you know you dive into a project or into new material you get stuck in it and you can't really it's like you're on the bottom of a well and you're like trying to figure out how to get out or the other sounds and then all of a sudden somebody else has more input or like it's they nice hear for something. somebody to go stop working on Critiques. that song yeah. it's not worth it yeah, you're yeah. like okay yeah. cool thanks so so uh, she'll that be shit. that critical yeah, she, oh, yeah. she's she's yeah. already been great and and we've been going back and forth and yeah i mean the, the next step is just getting down there and um, you know, we're, we're trying to raise the funds. It's a big commitment for us. Um, we really wanted to do it right and, and do um, the album that we, we hear in our minds. And since Sylvia is just sort of, it seemed like uh, listening to her material that she's done in the past and the song that she did for us, it was so easy for her to sort of get what we wanted, the, the sound and we heard it back. And we all got up and embraced her when we heard the first playback. We were like, wow, that sounds exactly the way it should sound. So, yeah, we, we basically told her we would do whatever it takes to, to get down there. And, and she she's, um, wants us to spend 21 days. So it's, uh, it's, it's an investment for us. And we're like... I wake up every day like a little giddy schoolgirl, like, oh, my God, we're going to make a record. Yeah, Are that's got to be exciting, you know, yes. having your, your dreams uh, manifest. So you're... Uh, it's a big investment, so you need to raise money and stuff. Yeah, we're um, we're probably going to do a little crowdfunding and um, and, uh, and and we're we're Everybody you know, we're saving to... every penny that we uh, we have, you know, and, and we're gonna we're gonna make it happen. Yeah. We're so excited. Everybody I talk to, you know, every artist in varying phases of their career, like I had the Jayhawks on a couple days ago, they've been in every kind of major, minor label configuration, and yeah, they crowdfunded their last record, and it went really well for them. So it just seems like an awesome model. Well, and it's also an interesting way that we kind of have to do things now, just as you know, as artists, as, as people. But um, and it's, it's more community oriented, you know. It's like, oh, yeah, I, we support each other. I know, right? It's, it's that's a weird thing, the, but that's kind of the KEXP model. It's great. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, for people to find out more information, they should just go to your website. Absolutely. Thunderpussyusa.com. Yeah. Thunderpussyusa. Thunder Pussy USA. Yeah, there'll be, there'll be some information there if people feel inclined to help out. They can uh, be steered in the right direction to throw us a bone, and <laughs> every little bit counts, you know? Yeah, absolutely. So then the plan is you're going to go down, you're going to record, then what happens? Do you have, are you going to put it out yourselves? Are you going to kind of see who's interested? Yeah, I mean, it's a great question. <laughs> Anybody interested? <laughs> one step at a time. <laughs> okay, you do them one step at a time. <laughs> exactly. Um, well, let's do another step then. How about some more music? Yeah. Uh, again, Thunder Pussy live on the afternoon show and playing the Capitol Hill Block Party tomorrow at 445. Go down there, hear some new songs and some old favorites.
Thunder Pussy live on the afternoon show, KEXP. Last track, Thunder Pussy, the uh, song before that, Welcome to the Disco, both of those songs with the Thunder Pussy dancers. <laughs> uh, beautifully choreographed uh, routine there. That's called the Pussy Foot, Kevin. Excellent. I like we'll the Pussy Foot. We'll teach you later. Excellent. I, I want to learn that. So when I watch the band, I, I definitely I want to dance or at least go work out and run. <laughs> like, I'm so inspired, the amount of energy that you put out and... Uh, and just the beautiful moves and the choreography, it's just incredible, um, in addition to the exceptional music musicianship. Wow. Yeah, we've, we've got our dancer here, Molly Sides. You can't stop her. Like, she just, <laughs> she just dances. I had to wrangle her <laughs> to even sing. I was like, Molly, just keep the microphone. Well, it's incredible. Molly, I, I, I know that you're, you've been a choreographer and perhaps a performance artist. Uh, how important <laughs> is the theatrical element and the visual component to Thunder Pussy? Oh, I think, it's, not I think, I know. <laughs> it, that's very important to all of us, not just me. Yeah. But, yeah. Um, there's a video for Welcome to the Disco that's just beautiful, and it looks like a high-budget production. <laughs> uh, yes, no. <laughs> That's you know, we're, it's, yeah. <laughs> we have our ways. We yeah. have our ways. It's no, we we had a gr we had an incredible team for that. I mean, we have an incredible was... team that takes care of us for pretty much everything. Yeah. Well, <laughs> doesn't take they take care of everything with us. <laughs> they're they're a powerhouse. I meant, I meant video wise. Oh no, no, we can't. Shoot you're the videographer, <laughs> and I can't take care of myself, so <laughs> it works out. It's important to have a, uh, have a, a wonderful team, including dog walkers for sure. <laughs> Again, Thunder Pussy, thank you so much for coming by. For me, yeah. it was really exciting. It, and for me, I felt important to capture you at this point in your musical evolution. That means so much to us, Kevin. Honestly, thank you, does Kevin. Thank you. Yes, yes, it really does. Yes. Thank you, oh thank you so much for having us, and thank Wait. you for all your kind words and encouragement. I mean, oh. you, you and everybody at the station has yeah. always been so wonderful to us. It's, it's our pleasure, and can't wait to have you back after you record the album. Oh, definitely. Can't wait yeah. to hear it. Definitely. Have a great time. Okay. Thank you, Kevin. Big well, time. Thank you so much. <laughs> Big time thanks to, uh, to Scott, Alia, Jim, and Justin on video, Sunita on uh, taking photographs. All that will be up uh, soon. Uh, Kevin doing the engineering, Kevin Suggs, Reeves uh, on board hopping, and Emma and Joseph and Larry Rose helping out behind the scenes. Thunder Pussy live on the afternoon show. It's KEXP Seattle. Discover great music at kexp.org.